Right there guys, Josh here, episode 3, and uh, we need a title change real quick, because Root the Glory sounds really cheesy, so I'd appreciate it very much if you can put a comment below on what I should actually change the series to the actual title to, so if you've got any suggestions. I'm thinking because I'm going for an actual inform team, maybe we could keep it like linked to that, like kind of theme, like because I'm got going for an actual full inform squad. But uh, this guy, he had a pretty good team, he had Hulk up front, and uh, everyone knows how good he is. He had one in defence, and he had Montalivio in the centre of midfield. Pretty beast of a team, really. Um, but I just want to quickly say this, guys, this trolling uh, since the Anto incident needs to stop, because me and Anto made the peace, guys, and it just doesn't look good, you know. So all this trolling just needs to stop, guys, because at the end of the day, we're here to make FIFA videos. And that's what we're going to start doing now. Um, some nice goals there, you know. A little, little side foot volley by Henri doing the business. And it was pretty convincing win this first match. Um, I do believe I win 3-0. And uh, Shignac, I think he gets the second goal right now. He t takes the ball and then he just he's just clean through. And all, all I end up doing is just like going past the defender and then just slotting it in easily. Just going for the easy win. Getting Shignac some goals and... Uh, pretty convincing win in the end but I just want to say this as well guys um, I'm not really going to focus on the, the in a lot of the episodes on like the coin making aspects because it will get boring you just sitting there watching me just like buying bronze packs and then like selling on the players and stuff but at the moment that's literally all I'm doing but here's this guy that I bought for 3,100 coins beware guys I actually bought him two weeks ago he could be a lot cheaper now because of the newly announced team of the year squads but that was Musa Sissoko and he ends up being like a pre another good player and it's actually my first informed player that I buy for my team and he's a beast um Musa Sissoko plays for Toulouse I believe and he's a right tank this guy he had like Petric and uh Van Nistelrooy up front and uh he ends up taking the lead like a sloppy defending by me it was oh man it's you know when you watch it's like when I watch myself defending in this I'm like oh god no no I mean, I just blame it on the chemistry, but I know it's just sloppy, sloppy defending. But I end up getting, um, just going for the little equaliser here. I'm not really focused. In this series, I'm not really focused on just always trying to do skills. You know, I'm, I'm actually trying to win, obviously. And, I mean, I obviously try and win when I'm playing matches, when I'm just going for skills. But, you know, I've got a more... Does that match bonus is at stake, and I'm, I want to win. Like, so... I'm going for the win desperately and I end up doing a nice little Maradona roulette past him and then I go on to like strike it in the corner and uh, Gignac's proving to be a real real good buy at the moment with the assist and then the, that goal there and I think I get another goal here and then make it like it's just like in the bag really this guy he was I was literally I was actually dominating him he, he, I was pretty surprised because I did I actually thought it would actually like cause any problems with those two forwards up front because they're pretty pretty tough players they're not really renowned for their pace but they're renowned for their finishing and a pretty convincing win in the end and I get the goal here as well to make it 4-1 and you know seeing it out he ends up scoring a consolation in a minute but it was pretty pretty convincing but again I was talking about the coin making aspect guys um, I, I can't really see why you'd want to watch me just like buying bronze packs and then selling the players I mean, when I obviously do start using other methods, I'll bring them in, but I'm not really going to focus on that. I'm going to focus on the goals and stuff. You can see how I'm advancing. End up buying a new stadium here because I was sick of being in matches with rain, and I'm pretty glad I haven't had any uh, so far in the series, like which I haven't seen. I haven't been in any matches with rain because I play crap in the rain. End up getting the Stad Velodrome, and it's a pretty nice stadium for 150 coins as well. This guy here is one of the matches when um, my team's pretty much like more more powerful than his if you know what I mean I mean he's got some silver players he's got more I mean I've got more bronze players than him I think but he's got some silver players and I had more go I had the gold players that done the business and then Musa Sissoko big lad with that fine finish like in the bottom corner I mean a lot of people ask me why um you see the shot meter go up and up and up and up and up I don't know it's just I don't even know why I do that it just it just I just seem to do it for some reason and I just I don't stop doing it. and it, I found that it keeps the ball lower so I've just kept doing it and it works actually and then there's Zignac again with another finish and he's just proven to be a worthy addition to the squad he's like he's just finishing his all-round game is just beast he's got so much power in his shot it's crazy you'll see some nice goals from him in the next episode I think as well and uh 
So I'm just going to kind of like try and focus more in the episodes on the goals aspects. Like, but I was wondering if you wanted me to actually include highlights, like, so you can actually see like if it was a close game or not. Because uh, I don't know. I've seen other people doing that, and it seems like that. And to anyone who thinks I'm not doing um, player of the week again, I will be doing that after I get a backlog of these episodes rendered, guys. So I will be going back to that maybe in about two weeks. And a team of the week, um, maybe in a month or so, I'll go back to that. I'm not sure. Ultimate teams is where it at right now, and I just like Ultimate Team. I'm I'm not really like enjoying head-to-head -head matches. So um, Thierry on really that you just saw the first goal there, and then he gets another advanced rainbow flick here, and a bit of needless skill, but he finishes easily, and then he rage quits, as you'll see in a minute. But I hope you enjoyed this episode of episode 3 and um, if you did, I'd appreciate if you leave a rating guys, preferably a like and uh, peace out guys, hope you enjoyed.